For any two real numbers, a and b, and any positive integer, n, if a to the n equals b, then a is the nth root of b. For example, here we have the expression 2 to the 4th power is equal to 16. Here, a is 2, b is 16, and n is 4. This means that 2 is a 4th root of 16. Here's how we write nth roots. The square root symbol with an n next to it indicates an nth root. Here, 100 is the number, is the radicand. We have a radical sign above it, and n is called the index. So here we're saying we're taking the nth root of 100. We could put any we could put almost any number there, like a 2 or a 5 or a 7. We would be taking that root of 100. Now some numbers have more than one real nth root. For example, 100 has two roots, 10 and negative 10. In this case, the non-negative root is called the principal root. When no index is given, a radical sign indicates the principal root. So for example, if we take the square root of 100, we're talking about its principal root, which is 10.